guys, it's William calling from Wooby Blogs, and we're here in the A Doll Studios with Past. Hey, hey no. <laughs> Now, so we understand that two of you are twins, and we can figure out it's the girls. How did you meet these guys? Um, we met each other on Facebook, so we started uh, talking, and that's how because the boys were living together in a flat, so. So it was essential that we studied it. To do music together, as we be we became friends and like oh, we both did music, so it was essential we do it. And like funny came because she can play the harp pretty pretty good, and uh, David is good at electronic music. And yeah, what are you good at? Um, well, I'm I guess I'm good at electronic music, and I'm sure Dori is good at singing and playing the harp too. Have is very good with drums. I mean, not uh, real drums, but this electronic programming kind of. them. Yeah. Yes, yeah, and very he good. plays the piano for, for 30 years now. Yeah. And all of you guys are really young. Could you tell us your ages? The girls are 19, 19, and David is 22, and I'm 20. And so you all are sisters. Um, so probably very good friends. Do you ever get in big, you know, sister sister fights? <laughs> well, <laughs> sometimes, yeah, we do. Well, <laughs> we are really good um, sisters because uh, we are twins, so we spend our free time together and we play music together because because we are classical musicians and we had a duo with two harps and we play in an orchestra, so we do a lot of music together. And who's older? What do you think? You guess. You both look so young. I don't know. <laughs> um, I'm gonna say the dark hair, Dory. You're older. Yes. You're right. Mm -hmm. yeah. With two minutes. She seems very mature. Really. <laughs> you just finished school, so you're a relatively new band. Is this your first project together? Yes. yes. It is. Definitely. It's our first song. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We we started this band in August, and this is our first ever song together. And uh, yeah, we are here. <laughs> It's a very good sign if your first song makes the final of A Doll. Did you expect this to happen? Well, no. We we didn't think that we will be in the live show, but when it happened, we were so surprised and happy that we started practicing more and uh, and really really enjoy it. And we hope that we can uh, be the one who can go to the Eurovision Song Contest. And when you were writing the song "Mesmerize," was it difficult, or did it come very natural? It was very natural, actually. Um, Levi had to make an exam, uh, the song for an exam, and uh, we decided to make it together. And uh, it was like for three days, I was like, "Okay, five minutes," and I will start <laughs> writing the music. Okay, five minutes again. And nothing happened. Yeah, for three <laughs> days, and then, like in. We wrote it in 10 minutes, and then uh, Levi uh, wrote the drums and stuff like that. And then we decided to um, compete in Adal, and uh, we made a new version of uh, of the song with Fanny and David. Yeah, we we pretty much uh, rewrote this party part of the song. Yeah. yeah, and the lyrics. So we changed the lyrics. So and the and, and, the, and the vibe changed a little bit. It's like better now, I guess. What's the song about? It's about love, basically. But we want to show that uh, Budapest and Hungary is uh, really. Um, they they has know. that vibe, you know, that that mm -hmm. good vibe. Beautiful city, beautiful bridges, uh, and fountain, and everything, and we really like living here. And it's a cool place now, yeah. so we wanted to show that uh, that uh, Hungary is uh, is fashionable and full of talented young people. Yes. And uh, we try to to push this this limit, like um. There's a lot of artists who who are really talented in Hungary, and we we, we try to be one of them. <laughs> <laughs> and do you guys follow Eurovision? Do you have any favorite artists or songs? Uh, this year? Uh, any year. Well, I like the Hungarian contestants. They were pretty good. I mean, by Alex and uh, Andras Kali Sanders. I like them very much. Well, there are a lot of, lot of great songs, but maybe. Really long, long, long time ago, Abba 
um, won, I think, with with uh, this uh, thing, like two boys and two girls. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, so we, it's um, unique for us. And I can't help but notice the two twins look very different in terms of hair and, you know, blonde, brown. Is this deliberate? No, we're just different. Not just yes. on the outside, but in the inside. Mm -hmm. We are really different. We are two different person. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Great. And, you know, you're in a competition with Cody Wolf, with Bogey, some big names, um, and they're used to people criticizing them. Is it difficult to hear criticism because you're in a competition? No, not at all. It's good to hear it because that's how we can learn. And uh, we don't take it personally, these uh, criticisms. We try to handle them professionally yeah. yes, and we progress because, yeah, mm -hmm. because of them. And we noticed that after the first heat you changed your dresses. You went from red and white to blue and green glitter. What can we see tomorrow in the final? Well, uh, mm, we will wear the same clothes because the, uh, our idea was that in the first time we can show the style of the 60s. Uh, with these uh, dresses and then the 80s because it's fashionable now and um, we will play two songs with, together with the other artists and, uh, and mesmerize. mesmerize and we will wear both of them yeah we wanted to change but yes. uh, it was just one week uh, after yes. the semi-final we didn't yeah. have time yeah, yeah. To, so, to change our clothes change I mean not to change but to Find new, uh, find new ones, yes. it was pretty difficult. Like yeah. mm -hmm. And you know, regardless of what happens, if you don't win, will you still stay together as a band? Yeah, absolutely. Definitely. Mm -hmm. We are playing our first EP. We have uh, like two songs completed, or almost completed, and uh, we're gonna record one new. Mm -hmm. And uh, we're gonna release that EP sometime. It's gonna be like, a four song EP and yeah. it's in pretty good shape right now. We're gonna work on it in March and maybe in April too. Mm -hmm. Fantastic. And a final question for the four of you. Do you have a message for all of your new fans all over Europe? Yeah. We love them. We hope <laughs> they like our song and they enjoy this uh, show, the Eurovision Song Contest. Yeah. And it's hard to believe they exist and there's so much fans out there. Yeah. Like, it's pretty good and we're happy. Mm -hmm. You guys, it's the Hungarian ABBA. They might win Adol, they might win Eurovision. You heard it here first on Weeblogs. Thank you so much. Kussi! Oh, <laughs>